fine boy. Fine boy! It is What think you come here? Don't play while till they forget to ask you. Tell me, ask you. I be one man who you. Police. I think they worry you. Now, what did I ask you? Which offense you commit? Tell me, what think you come here? Which offense you commit? Huh? Which offense will you commit? I did not commit any offense. Oh, oh, oh. So here I don't become heaven. Where person will not commit anything they enter. Abi. You don't want to talk to me. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, I I'm, 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 I'm here because I'm here because I, I, I'm being accused of, of raping my, my my female student, a girl of 14. That's where you teach for your class, Abi. Chairman, I did not do it. Shut up! You know the man? Abi. No, they work. Eh? Um, Chairman. I did suggest uh, as in the teacher. Eh? Main the teachers. People were there inside this place. Including people who could enter. As we know, go school. Abi, you talk to me. From today. Now you go be our teacher. You could teach every one of us. All of us waiting here. You could teach all of us. Plus the people we go enter me. You hear? Which which people you the teacher? Which you the teach them? I, I I I teach in a secondary school. I'm, I'm very vast. I, I teach um, Christian religious knowledge, mathematics. Okay, okay, okay. You the teach everything. From today, now you go be our teacher. Eh? Other people where they come, you go teach them. Uh, Bakuna, clap. Fine boy teacher, please. Harry. So, are you sure you saw her taking the money? I'm very, very sure, sir. In fact, I'm 100% sure. When we all went out for sports, Master Cole asked me to go get his skin from the classroom. Uh, when I entered the class, I saw her driving with blessing school bag, and she was shocked the moment she saw me. Elena, I will ask you for the very last time. Where is the money? So I did not. I didn't take any money. Lie. When Harry came into the classroom, did he ever see you with blessings bag? Um, the, the, the bag was on the floor, so I, I helped the owner to pick it up. And what were you doing in the classroom when? Every other of your mates had gone to the sports center. I, I, I went to adjust my sports vest. Then the money grew wings and disappeared, right? That's what you want me to believe. I'll prove to you that I know how to handle people like you. Okay, come this way. Hence, you refuse to say the truth. Nida! Harry. So, thank you very much. In fact, I'm proud of you. We need more of your type in this school, you know. Kids who can always say the truth. And you're good as okay? Go back to your classroom. I'll get back to you when I'm done with that. What sign were you giving to him? Sorry, Where's your hand? I didn't make any sign. Where's the money? I'll get up. Hello! 
I have to search you. I'm sure you've stolen some money. Come here. Where's the money? Come here. Come here. My friend, you move again, I'll slap you. Are you are you okay? What's wrong with you? Huh? My friend, come here. What 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 is this? What is it? Bring, bring it out, bring it out. I want to see. Bring it out. <coughs> Sir, please, it's a mistake. Bring it out first. Oh. So you actually stole the money. Again. I know it won't happen again. Of course it won't happen again. You are a disgrace to this school. And I will show you, I, I will use you as an example to the entire school. I'm going to take you around each classroom and you're going to get six strokes of my cane. Okay? You think I'm joking? Now turn around. I need to search you more for that money. How many money? How, many, how much have you stolen from that for today? My friends, one. what is wrong with you? Just this one. For you. Wait, wait. wait. I want to see if you have other people's money with you. Just there's, there's still some money with you. No. Hence your body has become bank. No. Eh? It's only that one. Money bank. No. Only that one. You're sure? No. Hey, no. my friend. Are you? No. Are you crazy? No. Shut up. What is wrong with you? Stay. Stay. Stop crying, okay? I pardon you. I forgive you. And I'll make sure nobody hears about this. Alright? Something just suddenly, you know, pricked me. And I felt this, this love for you. I love you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I'll make sure nobody hears about this, okay? You have to behave yourself, okay? Hmm? Yeah, come here. Come here. Now, come. Go to my toilet and wash your face, okay? You've been crying. Come on. Go. Go. <laughs> There's a problem, a serious problem. There has been an accident. Accident? Honestly, an accident. Holy Jesus. I, I, I hope nothing happened to you. The, I'm fine, I'm fine. But the, 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 the bus driver, the school bus driver, is lying critically in the hospital. Jesus. After knocking down a young boy. I don't know if that boy is going to survive it or not. What? The school bus is is damaged beyond repair after, after running into, into a big tree. Reverend, please, you really have to pray for me. Please, you have to pray for me. You need to pray for me, please. Give me a hand. Holy Father. 
father, the walk of Gilbert, the man of Zion. Lord, we look up to you today. So when solving problems on fractions, addition and subtraction, which is plus and minus, must be treated as one family. Likewise, multiplication and division. Now, if an expression contains only plus and minus, you don't need to apply the rule of board mass. Also, if an expression contains multiplication and division, the rule of board mass does not apply. But if the two families are mixed in one expression, then you can apply the rule of board mass. Now, who can tell me the full meaning of board mass? Board mass mean bracket of division, multiplication, yes. addition, and subtraction. <laughs> <laughs> Since mathematics is a practical subject, I will show you some more examples to express this theory. Good. Now, two. Good morning, sit down, everybody. Okay, everybody stand up so we can say a word of prayer. So we let's start. Stand up so we can pray. I said, stand up! Sir, she's not feeling fine. Will you shut up? Up! Did you hear me clearly? I said, stand up! Why are you bleeding? I said, why are you bleeding? I'm on my period. Ah, oh, stupid idiot. Fool. Nehi. Ninkompop. Dirty girl. You're on your period and you don't know how to wear sanitary pad? That's very responsible of you. Now get out. Go to the sick bay now. Get out. I'm going to treat yourself. Out, out, out. Everybody close your eyes. Let's say a word of prayer. And thank God for the life he has given us. In Jesus' name. Amen. How is she? She's okay, but this is beyond ordinary menstruation. What do you mean this is beyond ordinary menstruation? She had an abortion. What? She had an what? Yes, sir, but she'll be fine. Abortion? Okay, when she wakes up, um, 
bring her to my office. You see, uh, I would love it if you tell me the truth. I mean, confide in me. Tell me the whole truth and nothing but the truth. At this point, I won't want you to see me as your principal. Just see me as your bosom friend, your pal, you know, tell me the truth. The question I'm, I'm about asking you now, it's not as if I don't know the answer. I sure know the answer. But I want you to tell me the truth. Did you have an abortion? I... I... No, 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 try and understand me. Listen, I, I love you so much and nothing will change that. Not even your whatever state. Okay? Maybe you don't understand me, okay? I'll prove it to you. Now that you've told me the truth, you see, and maybe it's God's will that you be my wife someday, and maybe it's His will that this thing will bring us together. You see, all this while when I see you in classroom, I, I feel, I feel I love this girl, you know, and I want to marry her. And it's just a feeling inside of me. Will you marry me? Listen, I really have a boyfriend. No, 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 but he's not your husband. He's not. I'm for real, girl. Maybe when you leave your secondary school, you become my wife. And I'll fly you abroad. Huh? Then we'll be together. Come on. Hmm? Now come into my hands. Sand. Come on. Conversation is a branch of mathematics that deals between the difference between one quantity and another. Now, differentiation is divided into two. Calculus and integration. Now, this branch of mathematics was derived or formed by two different people. One, Newton. Two, Leibniz. Now, calculus. Um, sister, your son is a great man. Because what has happened to him cannot happen to an ordinary man. But do not see it as the end of the road. See it as a transition to greatness, your son's greatness. By the time you realize what God has in store for you after this problem, you will know that our God is truly wonderful. My beloved sister, please see this problem as an evidence that your son is moving ahead. Do not forget what our Lord Jesus Christ said in the book of St. John chapter 16 verse 33 and Revelation chapter 7 verse 14. May the peace of the Lord be unto you. Amen. Pastor, 
Thank you very much for your word of encouragement. My prayer is that the good Lord will bless you. But Pastor, Pastor, 21 years is too long for me to be at this pain all alone in this place. Oh, but eternity is so long for you to enjoy the blessing of the Lord. The only thing you need now is faith and hope. Only that can make miracles happen. Let us pray, sister. My Lord and my God, you said it in your word that those hoping on you is like mountain Zion that will never be moved. I want you to impart that word in this, my sister, O oh Lord. What is that doing on him? Remove that thing from his hand. Come on. You're a man, sit down. So how come such a good teacher? Sir, that was what I did before I got locked up, sir. Where were you locked up? Sir, I, I was accused of raping one of my female students, but sir, believe me, I didn't do it. Yes, okay, so that's it fast, huh? It's okay. Relax. Do you still have the zeal to teach? Yes, sir. It's my calling. That, that's what I'll continue doing forever, sir. Okay. Well, I'm currently, I'm running a part-time program in one of these universities. So, um, I would like you to be my personal teacher. Sir? It's okay, it's okay. Um, if I'm... Sir. Um, take good care of him, eh? Wash him up and then. Uh, I'll see you later. The just shall live by faith. The innocent will be vindicated. It doesn't matter how long it takes. Kiss God. Will judge the case. Nika, how dare you badge into my office that way? Huh? Have you lost your manners? Are you okay? There's a problem. Problem? What problem? Okay, now, sit down. What is the problem? Okay, I've been vomiting for the past three days now. So I went for a medical checkup. And the test result confirms that I'm pregnant. Is that why you're sad? Sad? I mean, yes, you, you can be sad when there, there is a solution. What solution? Listen. Do you want to have a child while you're still in secondary school? I don't know, they're in your hands. Girl, beautiful. Yeah, I remember I told you that I was going to marry you when you leave school. Fine, but now you're pregnant. You can't, you can't carry pregnancy in school and we can't get married while you're pregnant. So we have to abort it. That's the way out. Abortion. 
I can't. For God's sake, that's risky. That's not healthy for me. I'd rather keep the pregnancy. For who? For who? For you, of course. You must, really must be mental. Kolo, mental case. Huh? Look, you, what do you think you're doing? I want 50% of your salary every month. No, that's not possible. Eh? Okay. What? How are you going to take my... No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Come on, baby. Honey, come on. What? What's the problem? I agree. Fine. Let me get a salary ledger. You don't have to see. You have to look at my ledger. I need to know what I'm entitled to every month. My salary ledger. Do you really mean I should give you my side? Oh, oh, okay, wait, wait, wait. It, it, it's, it's right here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do you have to do this? You're not really down with this business, are you? I, I, I don't know, but you, you, you look at your conscience. Okay, how about this? Oh, 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 fine. It's okay. Go, go ahead. Seeding properties can be used to simplify the square roots of numbers. For example, the square root of 96 could be broken down to the square root of 16 times 6, which is further broken down to root 16 times root 6. Now you know the square root of 16, don't you? Which is 4. So 4 root 6. Now, 4 root 6 is the simplest form of the square root of 96. So are we communicating? I'm with you. You're such a good teacher. Even my professor could not break it down like this to me. That's such a wonderful... Uh, let's continue, sir. I'm now, the square root I'm of... I'm, I'm so tired. I need some rest. Alright, sir. <laughs>
sorry, you. Please now be in my room for my sake, please. Masi chukun. Oh my god, what is happening to me now? Hey, this has grown beyond ordinary to be oh. Oh god, in the name of Jesus. Every hand that is holding my family into captivity and come against me so in the mighty name of Jesus. Any and any kind of enemy in my family for that Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. Holy Ghost fire. God, you are the Lord and He led me. Oh God, I don't know what to do again. God, I want to be prayer. Please help me. Now there's no other place I can go. What is happening to me? The little boy has finally given up. God of mercy. God. And his family is demanding for the sum of 10 million naira as compensation. What? Where on earth am I going to get that kind of money from? That's a huge amount. Uh, what if we take them to court? The father of the boy in question is a lawyer. And he's related to the governor of the state. Oh, terrible. This is really terrible. Reverend, I don't know what to do. I think my husband has a hand in what is going on. Your husband? Yes. He's a cultist. Ever since I divorced him, he's been making this life miserable for me. He even asked me to quit this environment. Uh, you mean as in quit this site? Yes. So can I have my money for this month? Of course, yes. Why not? But please sit down. Thank you, but I've not come to stay. Do you remember I promised you that I'm going to treat you like my wife? Okay? Yeah, I have something very special for my baby. Yeah. So we can share this, you know, and uh, cheers to our newfound life. A newfound us. Yeah, so uh, why don't you toast to our love? This would be just fine, but I want the money first. Oh, why not? Come on, you, you have the money, you get the money. Here. 55,000 Naira. I added 5,000 Naira to prove to you that it's from my heart, this whole thing ain't scam, you know? I mean it. And I said, you're mad. So can we have a toast to my new found wife? For the drinks, let's drink. Mm. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Thanks for this. Exactly what he told me. That he's your only son. And he gave me this to give to you. What for? If they've killed him, why not tell me? Just go ahead and tell me that they've killed my son. Why are you giving me envelope? What for? Eh? I believe, madam, that this envelope will tell better. <laughs> I said it. I said it. They've killed my son. And they want to give me money in exchange. You want money to buy my son? What do I need this money for? Where is Andrew? Take your sticky money away. I don't need it. <laughs> God, I know you are up there. Where are I say until my son's death? You will not go free. Madam, <laughs> this is not a blood stinking money. This is a real money. <laughs> Your son Andrew, he's on the line. Andrew? Speak with him. Hello, Mama. Andrew, is this Andrew's voice? <laughs> yes, Mama, it's my voice. Andrew, Andrew, do you have a phone in prison? <laughs> Mama, you can more or less say I'm in the palace now. Yes. Eh? Which palace, Andrew? Hey, and I know you've not escaped with other prisoners, eh, Andrew? Uh, wow. Of course not, of course not. You see, uh, the innocent cannot cry forever. You know, problems sometimes mean uh, progress to the righteous. Yes. Uh, Mama, uh, with the money I sent you, um, please uh, uh, um, get a house in the city. Eh? Two years, right? Yes, you shall see me soon, Mama. I might have to go now. Alright, go on. Bye. Hello? Hello? Hey! Andrew! Hey, God! Hey, Andrew is alive! Now. Hey! Andrew! Hey! Andrew! Hey, bless God! Wait, oh, excuse me. When am I going to see Andrew? Oh, madam, very soon. It's 
well with him. Hey! God! Hey! Andrew! Praise the Lord! Hey! Andrew is alive! Hey! My friend is alive! Stop crying. Huh? Talk to your husband. Come on. <laughs> my, my mother has threatened to kill me if I don't tell her you pregnated me. Oh, oh, is that why you're crying? Oh, no, you don't have to cry over that. I mean, uh, just. I promised I was going to marry you. Huh? Yes. Getting pregnant only makes it faster. So wipe your tears. Huh? Sir, won't I finish my secondary school? No. You follow your education abroad. Look, just, just go ahead. Tell your mother I'm the father of your baby. Okay? Sir, so you want it? Yes. Of course. And I mean it, okay? Now wipe your tears, come on. Wipe your tears. Hmm? Wipe your tears. Listen, let me give you a drink so we can celebrate our newfound love. Huh? Yeah. Huh? You see, my girl, I don't know why you allow yourself to be bothered by these things. Hmm? I told you I love you. And you don't know I mean it. I love you, girl. Now, oh, drink.
this thing honestly. You are dying. Yes, you refuse me to go and call the pastor. Why are you just being stubborn? Why are you being stubborn on my calling this pastor? I can't carry this thing alone again. I'm going to call him. This is more than I can carry on. This one is no more ordinary sickness. So. <coughs> By the virtue of what has happened, let us remember that there is God in heaven who is the owner of our lives. Let us lift ourselves in spirit and pray to God. Because we know that someday, a day we do not know, that we all are going to answer to this glorious call. Let us pray to God. Mr. Raphael, please lead us in prayer. Our God in heaven, you can see our hearts are heavy, but we blame you not. Because we know that in you we have hope for greater things to come. May the soul of our beloved daughter and sister rest in perfect peace of God the Almighty. Amen. Yes, she's gone. I must not let them tarnish my image. The whole world sees me as a holy man. And I must do anything to protect this integrity. Yes, anything. <laughs> Send on your power. We press the Lord. Lord Jesus, send on your holy ghost. We send Father, send on your power. We press the Lord. Send on your holy ghost. We send in Jesus' mighty name. Father, you say we should call upon you in our times of trouble and you will be there to answer us. Everlasting King, the King of Kings, the Rock of Ages, the omnipotent, the only science, Father. I call upon you to send down your Holy Ghost upon these children right now. Heal them, Lord Jesus. Send your healing power upon them, Father. Heal them, Jesus. Father Almighty God, I call upon you and I say, yes, let your will be done. Deliver them, Lord Jesus, from the sickness. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Blood of Jesus, set them free. Blood of Jesus, set them free. Oh, yes, Lord God. Every evil force that is responsible for their sickness, I come against them. I rebuke them. I destroy them. I terminate them. I cast them into the everlasting mist of fire. Shanta Barashinta, oh Jesus. I oh I trust in you. Please come down, Father. Come down, Lord Jesus. You are the Lord. 
You will not die. Tell that devil, you will not die. Father, Lord Jesus Christ, touch this people, touch the Father Shakaraki. Shintamara Shakaraki. Heal them, oh Jesus. Yes, Lord. No, Madam, Madam, the spirit of the world to just minister. And what did it say? We have to search for that man. We must seek for his forgiveness. And what are we waiting for? Anything, anything. I just want my daughter to be healed. Father, let's go, let's go. Is there any way we can get her new address? I don't know the address. You uh, mean? Nobody know where they're living now. I can't just tell. How? Madam, any problem? No, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. I hope there's no problem. It's okay. It's okay. 
Madam, madam, it's okay. It's okay. You don't need to cry. Rather, we need to search for him. Where can we go to now? What is to where can we go? The more time we waste, the more harm. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yes, he's truly innocent. Please don't say that again. Yes, madam. The young man is suffering for an offense her husband actually committed. What? Her husband raped Mercy? His own stepdaughter? I'm afraid so. We even went down to the prison in search of the young man, but he's nowhere to be found. Hi. Look, madam, for your own good, don't let another ear hear this. Just close this matter now. No, madam. I am not a supporter of evil. The truth has been told. So, let Howard say it. What am I protecting again? What? Have you thought about the disgrace? Madam, there's no disgrace as worse as that which that young man has passed through. Let us endeavor to see good and call it good. If you had investigated this matter from the initial point, that young man wouldn't have felt the prison. Wait, oh. Are you now blaming me for his imprisonment? What about the mother of the poor child? Of course she's not left out. See, I keep saying, you don't hate a child to train a child. You love the child in order to bring him up. I really don't know what's really wrong with our parents these days. Most parents feel that being harsh on their children is the best way to make them grow up responsibly. Whereas it is not. Can you imagine how many adults die every blessed day as a result of high blood pressure? Can you? Well, most of them develop this problem from childhood. And as for you, madam, if you had treated your daughter with love, she would be able to open up and confide in you. You see, you have a great task ahead of you. And until you look out for that young man, this image of a thing you're trying to protect will be humiliated. You need to search for him. You need to. I couldn't go to my father. I had to sneak out of the house. The first time let's me go. It's alright, it's alright, it's alright. You see, I, I was missing you in school today terribly. That's why I had to, you know, say you should come so we can just be together. So what do you want me to do for this? Ah, usual stuff. Hmm? No more thing. Mm, I'm sorry, you can't have it this time. I need to start going immediately. Lillian, what's wrong with you? I can't you, I mean, I mean, five minutes just won't be enough. In five minutes, I'm done. That is what you always say. But please, this time, I won't spend more than five minutes. Oh, that's my girl. Come on, my girl.
indeed a great loss. What shall we do? And to ask the Almighty to grant each and every one of us here the fortitude to bear this great loss. But it is a painful and shameful death for a young girl of our age to die in a hotel room. <laughs> Only God knows the kind of pleasure she went to seek in that hotel that led her to our untimely death. Her early grave. So this serves as a deterrent, serves as a lesson to all the teenagers, living teenagers in this place today. That living a responsible life can be equated to living a long life. This is an irresponsible life. So what more shall I say? Above all, we want to crave God to give everybody here the heart to believe in Him and to also know that He alone giveth and He has chosen to take away. May her soul rest in perfect peace.
You mean Reverend Fredo killed you? And that's why we have come to support you to destroy him. So come close and go down. There are many fellow students in his mortgage, including you. And there's only one way to escape this. And that way is this way. That will be the way. from what? You're my wife. Mm. <laughs> oh, are you too young to get married? Of course you know I'm too young for marriage. No, 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 you're not. I don't need it anymore. I, I don't know what came up for me these past few days. I'm very sorry. You're a very special person. I don't know why I should tell you the way I did. I believe you really wanted to marry me. I'm, I'm sorry. I still love you. But I don't know. Do you still love me? Of course I still do. Have you forgiven me? And you're quite forgiven. Are you serious? Oh. your mother in bed 
and you two, you are under the bed, and the man is nakanizing the both of you together. He must really have a big transformer, you know? A very big transformer. You you understand what I mean? You, you understand me? Yes. <laughs> you understand? Eh? Yes. 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 Sir, we don't understand what you mean by nakanizing a transformer. Yes. yes. So, students, the topic for today is faith in God. We are going to define faith in God and then we will now look at faith vis a vis relationship with God. Yes. Ha. But, sir, how does faith in God relate with mechanizing and transformer? Sorry? What do you mean? What, what, who said that today? But you said it, sir. Yes. Me, I said that. Yes, you said it. You said I said that. Yes. Something must be wrong with this, your big head. No, get, get, get out. I said you said it. You said I had something. 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 You said I And just come in now. Huh? Now go down your knees. Kneel down. Walk towards me. I'll punish you today. Walk, come closer. Huh? What? What do you want? Hey. What? Go back to your classes. Go. What's going on? How do you mean? I heard you came to school this morning naked. Me? Go out in the streets. It's everywhere. People are talking about it. Reverend, what is going on? What is that supposed to mean? Are you okay? Hmm? Oh! Reverend! Reverend! What is wrong with you? Oh! Reverend! Reverend, you're talking me! You're kidding! What? Thank <laughs> you. 
for God but has nothing but a wolf and sheep's clothing pretending to be holy but he's unholy he is seeking for souls to destroy all kinds of method he will employ to achieve his evil plans cause He's an evil man Beware of the wolf oh. In a sheep's clothing oh. Sheep's clothing Pretending to be holy mm. Holy, holy oh, oh. But he's nothing but a roaring lion Devour, to devour. Beware of the wolf oh. in a sheep's clothing. Cause he's unholy, unholy. Unworthy. unworthy. He's unholy. unholy. The days of the evil are numbered. Eventually his evil will be uncovered and he will be seen as he really is. Ooh, the evil one from the pit of hell is where he's from. Ooh, the evil one. Wicked can never go unpunished. In the end, he'll surely be finished. Uh, Beware of the wolf oh, in a sheep's clothing, 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 pretending to be holy, 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 holy. He's unholy, oh, he's unworthy. But he's nothing but a roaring lion. Seeking whom to devour, whom to devour. Beware of the wolf Ooh. in a sheep's clothing. clothing. Mm. He's unholy, oh, he's unholy, unworthy, unworthy. He's unholy, unholy. He's unholy, he's unholy, unworthy.
But I hung it here. Who took it? Who took my clothes? No. I will not go home this way. Definitely no. I better stay here till night than go home this afternoon naked. Oh. School compound, huh? <laughs> Why are you like this? What What is your business? Am I not supposed to be your wife? You are evil. I know you are evil. Look, leave, leave here now. Leave, leave, go, get, get out. Anyway, sorry, because there's no way to hide. <laughs> You are dead? You... You are dead too? You can't escape this. anybody I didn't kill anybody you see the, the soil you are standing on is my soil spiritually okay um, the husband of the proprietress sent me we actually wanted 16 million from her and she's refusing she's being stubborn so so I was sent why did you do that? because she was standing on my soil whatever is on my soil belongs to me but we are not madness why do you have to kill us Yes, you're not my best, but you're standing on my soil. So that makes you my own. You are innocent students. You won't have killed them. You're not innocent. Yeah. You are not. Yeah. But you're not. Yeah. No! <laughs>
time to go. But you don't have to go. It's time to go. We must go.